Phenom is an iPhone 12 and today I'll show you how to go through the setup of the device. So when you boot it up for the first time you will be presented with oh, this screen right here. So let's swipe up and then select our language and I'm gonna stick with English right here. Then choose your country or region. Uh, not really bothered so I'm gonna select the first one that is right here. Now for you, you should probably select your correct one. This will I assume determine the place, uh, the uh, Apple Store location, and also depending on like what region you selected, probably remove certain apps and uh, add ones that, for instance, you can only download in this this specific region. Uh, so let's get set up manually. Uh, right in spoken language, so English uh, keyboard English. Not seems to work for me. Uh, I believe if you want to change it you would have to go back or customize settings. Yep, there we go. So from here you can select the language. Let's stop on next and in here we will have to connect to Wi-Fi. Now you can either do it through Wi-Fi or by connecting to your computer. Uh, on that computer you will have to have an iTunes uh, otherwise you well, this won't really do anything. But I have network so that's what I'm gonna connect to. Now it seems like there is no way of finishing up the setup without either Wi-Fi or computer for some reason, so uh, I guess that's a little bit too bad if you don't have any. And once it progresses further, we just have to wait. And from here, simply let's go to continue. Face ID, so we can set up face ID if we want to by tapping on continue. If you don't want to, just choose set up later in settings create a passcode. Uh, again, if you don't want any kind of passcode, you can skip it by tapping on other uh, passcode, passcode options and selecting don't use passcode and then don't use passcode. Now if you want to, simply put in a pin uh, in there and call it a day. Then we have apps and data, so we can either transfer data from backups, uh, from PC, uh, from Android devices or iPhones or simply set it up as new by tapping don't transfer apps or data and that's what I'm gonna select and then we have the Apple ID so and here we can log into our Apple ID obviously uh, this will allow us to use uh, things like the App Store uh, to download apps uh, and also I believe it will automatically sign into uh, your emails and stuff like that but you can also skip it if you don't want to I particularly don't actually remember the Apple ID that I have so I'm gonna skip it by as you see in tapping on uh, forget password or don't have Apple ID and then selecting setup later and settings. And then we have terms and conditions so we can read it by tapping on leave right here. I guess that's it. So let's tap on agree anyway. And uh, keep your phone up to date, continue, nothing really we can do here. Uh, iMessages and uh, FaceTime. So continue um, select the uh, location services so I believe you can basically disable most of these if you want to you can do that later after the setup anyway so if that's something that you want to do just go right ahead uh, screen time um, iPhone uh, analytics actually I didn't want to share but oh well uh, app analytics continue true tone display uh, appearance uh, this is just a dark or light so whichever one you like more. Uh, display zoom, uh, just how zoomed in the text is as you can see and how big icons are. You can see a kind of slight difference on this tiny little image so select which one you want. And welcome to iPhone so let's swipe up and get uh, access to home screen. And there we go. So that is how you would set up your iPhone and if you found this video helpful don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.